could they treat him so bad? He was not guilty of insurrection. He was only guilty of opening blinded eyes. He was only guilty of unstopping deaf ears. He was only guilty of multiplying fish and loaves and feeding a hungry multitude. But as I asked the question, why are you treating my Lord in this fashion? I hear the words of the prophet Isaiah rumbling from 700 years of prophecy out of that 53rd chapter of his book saying he's not being beaten for anything that he's done but he is wounded for our transgression bruised for our iniquity the chastisement of our peace is upon him and it is with his stripes that we are healed they whipped his back to heal your backache. They nailed his hand, stretched his arms in order to heal your hands and heal your arm condition. They nailed his feet to take care of the condition in your legs and in your swelling ankles. Oh, glory to God. Well, why did they put a crown of 72 thorns on his head? Because most of our problems somehow end up in the head. They originate in the head. 72 thorns to take care of your migraine headaches. 72 thorns to take care of your ear, eye, nose, and throat condition. 72 thorns to take care of your psychosomatic illnesses. He was wounded for our transgression and bruised for our iniquity. But as he hung on the cross, bearing in his body, of our sin and all of our disease the worst suffering that he could ever have inflicted on him he looked in the heaven and heaven blacked out but before it blacked out he saw the father turn his back on him and he said Eli Eli Lama Sabachthani my God my God why have thou forsaken me? The glory to God. God had to turn his back on Jesus because when he looked on the cross, he couldn't see Jesus because he saw our sin. He saw your dope habit. He saw your alcoholism. He saw your cancer. He saw your AIDS. He saw all of our sin and all of our diseases Jesus and when he saw him covered with our sins he had to turn his back but my God hung out there way out on Calvary and he died all alone Isaiah already said he's got to do it by himself for he looked through prophecy and said who is this that cometh from Edom with God garments on from Bosra traveling in the greatness of his strength traveling and treading the wine press alone he said I looked and there was none to help so with my own arm I brought salvation unto me he did it all by himself oh, oh, glory Hell took a holiday. Demons were rejoicing. My, 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 my. They were saying, look at him up there. Uh-huh. He got away from our master back in the wilderness. He refused to bow down when Satan told him that I'll give you the kingdom of the world. He refused when the devil said, turn the stone in the bread. But look, we got him now. He's hanging on Calvary and I 
just heard him ask the father, why have you forsaken me? Demons were rejoicing and the saints were troubled, but he died out there by himself. And finally, when he said, Father, into thine hands, I commend my spirit because the body couldn't die as long as the spirit dwelled within. So he dismissed his spirit into the throne room of the father. Hey, and the father had already given him a challenge. The son said, I'm going down. Prepare me a body and I'll go and redeem man. But the father let him know, son, you are my son. But it's a hazardous trip you're taking. You're going to be tempted. You're going to be tested. You're going to be tried tried and your keys of authority are going to be buried in the very depths of hell and the only way you can collect your authority you got to battle the demons of hell but he said that's all right in burnt offerings and sacrifices for sin I have had no pleasure but upon it have thou prepared me then I said lo I come in the volume of the book it's written of me to do thy will, O God. While the demons were rejoicing, Jesus was dying. Oh, well, I don't care. Died until the earth began to reel and rock. Died until the sun blacked out. Died till the moon dripped in blood. Died till the Roman centurion smote himself on the breast and said we made a mistake this has got to be the son of God oh! Lord have mercy but when he died and I'm gonna quit Woo! Joseph went to get his body but I believe Joseph knew that it's not gonna be here forever. He just wanna borrow it for the weekend. And he laid him in his own new tomb. And that spirit that Jesus commended to the Father, while the body was reposed in sleep, the spirit went down into the deep recesses of hell and banged on hell's iron gate and said, lift up your head. Oh, ye gates, and be lifted up, ye everlasting doors, and the king of glory shall come in. A demon looked out and said, who is the king of glory? But I heard him say, the Lord. <laughs> 